Hey guys, it's Meg here. <clears throat> Welcome to my channel and thank you in advance for watching this video. I, I really do appreciate all your views and all your support on my channel. I am a new YouTuber and getting to make videos is just something I found really, really fun for me and a good pastime. Let me talk about this video a little bit. <laughs> um, currently I have been really loving the material of plaster. It's like, I don't even know how to explain it, it's like different kind of clay in a way. To me, I don't know. Uh, so I made a brick of plaster and if you want to know how to do that, um, you can just go watch a video I had posted up earlier on how to do that. But basically it's like two parts water to one part plaster for however much you need and you just let it dry for a good weekend or week like I did. But um, when I finally got the time to use it what I wanted to use it for, I was so excited to get started on it and it actually took me I think a good month, I mean, to do it. If I would have done it consecutively it probably would have taken me a good like four days. But um, what it is is a sculpture. I decided to do a sculpture out of a brick of plaster. I've never really done it before. Um, I do have this other thing I made uh, out of a brick of plaster and it turned out phenomenal. Give me a sec and I'll show you. So what I had to do out of, I had a class, I had a 3D design class and I thought it was going to be computer oriented but it was like sculptures and things like that and so one of our projects was to use the plaster to carve out of and to make a two-part mold which is one of my favorite things in the world to do is make a two-part mold call me weird i know but i had to i had a sculpt out of it and so i decided to make the two-part mold out of a light bulb which if you're going to do that don't use glass or anything because that light bulb cut me more than once and thank god light bulbs are reproduced you know so i could go buy another one and keep doing my mold <laughs> but ow um, and the other part I had to make complementary sculpture to it and so I decided to make a lamp. Um, so here's what it looks like. It's reflective and don't mind my, my room and my, my ghetto tripod. Look at this. But um, this is what the lamp looks like. This is the back and this is the front. And I basically just carved a um, little section, in, I think it's like one inch in, one inch deep out of all these and then I use E6000 and glued on mirror tiles. Um, I love, love, love the way it turned out. I, let me know if you want me to do a video on how, to, how I made that. I'd be more than happy to. Um, but back to this video. I did a sculpture of a pumpkin and I absolutely love the, the way it turned out. I mean granted there are some things differently I probably would have done um, and if you want me to explain what I, don't, what I would have done differently ask me below and I will definitely let you know. Basically this video is going to be a little bit different than normal. Um, <clears throat> if I had a bigger SD card I would have just filmed the entire thing and fast forwarded it for you so you could just see me making it continuously but I don't. And So the first part of it is going to be uh, more of like a slideshow of me sculpting it which was, that was tricky. <laughs> and then the last part of it is going to be a video of me decorating it. And I'm going to stop rambling on now and let you watch the video.
video. It, it is kind of different than what I'm used to um, editing, but gotta do what you gotta do. Um, if you want to see in person, look. I'm so happy with the way it turned out. Um, I don't know, maybe I should do something different with his eyeballs, but I just didn't know what to do. Um, I like the black in his, in his mouth, and I should have left the little stump thing here. <laughs> I forgot, I forgot, and then I realized after the fact, and I just threw away all my, like, broken off pieces, otherwise I would have painted it, glued it on there, but he's just gonna be bald, with no stuff. But, um, I love the way it turned out, I hope you guys really enjoyed this video, and, um, again, leave a comment below if you want me to film the, um, the lamp, one sec, <laughs> film how I did this and all the prices and where I got all the materials and all that good stuff, um, let me know. And I'm thinking about doing a Halloween series all um, craft video tutorial things up until Halloween. Uh, if that's a good idea, if you'd like to see me do that, let me know in the comments. Uh, if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate all your views and all your support. And um, thank you again, and happy Halloween!